We're just out here sharing the love of Christ. Uh, praise the Lord. The scripture says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son. And, they, and the world means everyone. Doesn't matter if you're an atheist, doesn't matter if you're a Christian that's backslidden, doesn't, mean, doesn't matter if you're a Muslim, Catholic, Jehovah's Witness, doesn't matter. Jesus Christ loves everyone. And the main thing why out here is to share the love of God and to, and to share that it's about a relationship with Jesus Christ. It's not about a religion. Jesus didn't come to restore no religion. He came to restore a relationship, which is why he died on the cross to reconcile us back to the Father. And our right, our right place and our right place is where we belong. We work from there, not towards there. We're born again. God bless. so much about you. You're probably thinking that we're just saying this just for the sake of it, but we're not. It's for real. Jesus died, not just for our sins, but for your sins and for the whole world. All he desires from you is a relationship, not money, nothing, just you. He wants your heart, he just wants you to trust Him, love Him. That's all He asks. There's a scripture that Jesus says in the Gospels. And He speaks not just to the believers, but to everybody. Come to me, all you who are weary and heavy laden, and I will give you rest. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Jesus says this. If you can hear me wherever you're at, I encourage you. Come to Jesus. Just stop trying to think you can do things on your own. You've experienced many failures in your life. And Jesus is waiting there just for you to call on his name. The Bible says, call on the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and you shall be saved. Just believe in him. Trust him. Jesus Christ loves you so much. And I'm not just saying that. If you have a Bible, I encourage you to read it. Get to know who your Savior is, who your God is, the one who loves you. He stepped off his throne to experience all the things that mankind experiences in hardships and pain, just so you don't have to go through it. And now all you have to do is just call on his name. It's that simple. If there's anybody out there who has not accepted Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior, I encourage you, come here right now. Come and get praise. Give Jesus a try. Open up your heart and let him rule and reign in your life. I encourage you. You have nothing to lose. God bless you, Lord.